the guard a lot of iron. So a lot of iron. <laughs> Man, you know, he was cold. Fucking make Professor Xavier look like an idiot. Yeah, Professor, bro. Profe yeah, Professor X is our Uncle Tom. He's a sellout. Always wanted to. Go oh, we gotta. Hey, he didn't want to conquer the humans. You know what I mean? That's that's that old weak spirit. And really, he's a good guy. That's a little subliminal message. They're trying to tell everybody to be a weak one. Right. It was like well, fucking Superman, the most powerful person on earth in the comic books he got him working for the United States government <laughs> I was like are you serious bow down bro I'd make everybody bow down right. I'd conquer the whole damn planet government and all that shit only made that's backwards right. back to second magazine story in 26 moreover two other young men appeared before him notable in strength excellent in beauty and calmly in apparel. Oh, uh, where you at? I just started a new video. What's that at? This is 2nd Maccabees 3. We read out of 2nd Maccabees uh, 3. I'm going to go back up to 25. For there Sorry. appeared, 2nd Maccabees 3 and 25, for there appeared unto them a horse with a terrible rider upon him, and a thorn with a very fair covenant. He ran fiercely and smoked at Heliodorus with his horse. And it seemed that he that sat upon the horse had to keep on his goals. Moreover, two other young men appeared before him, no one stood, excellent in beauty and comely in apparel. That motherfucker say, that's Satan. Well, Satan the most beautiful angel of them all. <laughs> Satan and his twin brother. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? <laughs> that's that bullshit. You're right. You know, Jacob over some shit. Moreover, because they did that, that, that bullshit in the church, man. They could make up that shit. Moreover, two other young men appeared before him, no one stood, excellent in beauty and comely in apparel. Who stood by him on either side and scourged him continually. They was just beating hell of his ass, man. And scourged him continually and gave him many solid strikes. Beating his ass. Man, man. Just beating their ass, man. And Helidorus fell suddenly into the ground and was compassed with great darkness. Compassed with darkness. <laughs> but they that were with him took him up and put him into a litter. Thus him that lately came with Damn. great rank train, and with all his guards into his Trash. play of tragedy, they carried out being unable to help himself, and with his weapons and manifesting, they acknowledged the power of the most God. They acknowledge the power. Did that say the part? You already read the part where it said he was stinking? No, that's another one. Oh, is that a different yeah, one? That, this is one where the, the angels came down and they whipped his ass. The, that one, the one you're talking about, they hit him the most high hitting with us. Uh, uh, an uncurable disease. The uncurable stank. <laughs> For real, bro. This nigga, shit, this shit crazy out here. <laughs> they probably do got heaters out here, though. Propane heaters. They like the NFL and shit. <laughs> I don't even know why either. Jake Love says. Oh, hey, look, we'll go back to that thing. I wanted to say a point real quick. Like, you ever hear, uh, you know, people, you know, that new abortion bill came out we was talking about. But they always, you know, the main reason why people say the abortions need to be legal is because what, if, what about rape? What if I get raped? What about, and what about incest? You know what I mean? Yeah, I saw that one. But how many bitches out here is actually getting pregnant from getting raped? Right. And what about incest? So they all, they must yeah. be having a lot of incest out here. Like that one dude, I forgot, you know that Ben Sharp, whatever his name, Ben Sharp, and shit like that. He'll be arguing and shit with people. Oh, yeah, I hate that motherfucker. Yeah, but well, he got some good points. Yeah, he does, he does. He even said it himself, because the same point you just said, he said, uh, because the some girl is like, not you call rape. He said, the majority of the people going to uh, get an abortion had nothing to do with rape. So you can't just use that for all abortions, nigga. You know what I'm saying? That's it. That's your choice. You being a hoe, you spread your legs, and now you pregnant. That's not good. That's not about stuff insurance. And incest. Well, because they just put on because they always say rape and incest. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. There must be a lot of incest going out here, dude. It is a lot. It is. It is a lot. Grandpa, fucking, you bunch of nasty motherfuckers out. You're just an average person. You shake, you say what's up to every day. 
he, you know, you know, an old dude up here acting like he got wisdom. He going home and making his little granddaughter blow him or something. You know what I mean? Yeah. Just the average everyday person is doing that. Yeah. Bunch of nasty people out here. That's how a lot of. That's what I noticed out of observation. I see a lot of homos, not homos, uh, homos. They, you know, like women and shit. They always like get turned gay when their father, or grandpa, raped them or some shit. Yeah, like I hate all men. Yeah. That shit is common, man. That's the brother and shit. And now they raped their little uh, uh, nephews too, and their sons and their grandsons, and little boys are getting raped by their own family. Uncle, I knew this one kid growing up. He told me, I think I told y'all before. He lived across the street from me. He came to told me one night, he's like, my uncle experimented with me last night. He's like, he told me it was just an experiment. I was like, why? I gotta get out of here. He said he fucking raped him in his asshole. That's fucked, that's fucked up, man. Actually, his name was, they call him, they call him Punk. Pumpkin, oh shit. A fag too. Tall ass fag. Name Pumpkin. Yeah, he's so uh, it came out. This was like around 86. Then his nephew who he was raping was named Reggie. Reggie came and told us that he put a thing in the booty. Oh man. Then Reggie at the time was like 19. That's fucked up. He came out and told us. At that time he didn't know, you know, to keep that shit to himself or yeah. you know what I mean? Yeah, I remember that man. Remember that shit? I'd probably kill some of this shit happened to me. Shit, you can get him put to death. And I'd probably kill my damn self. Yeah, fucking fag. They punked it. Everybody called him punked it. And he said, Fair Fawcett. Punked used to go around telling people, Fair Fawcett, told him how to dance. Fair Fawcett. Get the fuck out of here. That's a fact shit. Fucking fag. I think Pumpkin the preacher now. A preacher? I think so. He was on Facebook. I got on Facebook before we got over. I was back to cook doing that. Fucking fag. There's body, all these preachers out here are some fucking weirdos. What about that weird shit? We can edit it on fucking Facebook. You can't do that shit now. They just ban you. If you upset one person, if you say it, then you get suspended for a week. <laughs> like we used to go hard on Facebook. They ban your ass quick. It's good. Shit, YouTube shit ban your ass quick. I can't keep a YouTube channel. Fucking faggots, man. I'm literally on Facebook for 12 hours straight at times. Morning and going by. Every too many bitches on Facebook too. They distract you. You get caught up arguing with a bitch for fucking two hours. That's just a waste of time. Cause she ain't never gonna get it. That's funny you say that. Uh, I just seen this crazy bitch from uh that that used to always talk talk to us on Facebook. She just uh, cause I was subscribed to her on my one of my YouTube channels, and I just she just posted the first vid in like five years. Yeah, I just seen this crazy bitch's video. That's funny you say that. I just seen it. It was last night I was watching this crazy bitch's video. She was whacked out of her goddamn mind. <laughs> Shit, we should make other channels. I was thinking about getting on Twitch. I'm gonna put some videos on Twitch. Do the live stream. Well, it's all live streams, but it's not. You can do other shit on there. Twitch. It's mostly for video games, but they expand it. Yeah, them motherfuckers. video games need Mark too. They sure do. <laughs> That's how you do it. You just have a video game playing with you. Uh, do the voiceover. <laughs> oh yeah. What do you call that when people trolling them? I troll the fuck out of everybody. Hey, with my, cause I watch, uh, yeah, I got certain video game channels I subscribe to, like video game news and shit. I'm, I'm kind of into that shit, technology news. I be trolling the fuck out their comments. Anytime they say anything that's going off, like, of course, I'm leaving a comment. I troll, oh, damn. You almost got it, boy. 
Man, I be trolling the fuck out of YouTube though, for real. Hey, cause you know another thing too. Hey, nobody gonna find your channel. Shit. You know, the more you comment on videos, the more people find your channel. So it's good to leave comments on people's videos. They get something to click on. Especially if you really troll, so you get underneath somebody's skin, you know they gonna click on your channel. You know, when you trigger somebody, somebody get triggered, they gonna be all up on, they go, now they gonna be on your videos commenting. And that's why, that's when you got them. That's just something else, man. Y'all gotta learn, y'all gotta learn how, the art of trolling. The art of trolling and triggering. Y'all gotta know how to push them buttons. <laughs> It is, man. Some motherfuckers don't know how to come back at you or nothing, man. I know it got nasty out here, bro. I got you. I'm right there with you. So we just in the middle of having a godly conversation. Yep. You know? What you got? Oh, shit. So what's that scripture that Romans the uh Hey let me get it. Yeah, we, we, we put out, we're, we're put out there to call out foolishness and stupidity, man. See, that's our job. You know? Shit. And if that, you don't want nobody coming at you, don't go and don't post shit on the comic board. Don't put up no dumbass videos either. Hey guys, hey guys, what's up, man? Hey, guys, smoke it all. Yeah, I'm gonna get you. Damn, this shit gone. <laughs> hey, I got one. Well, trolling is just actually another name for teaching. Because you gotta be you gotta be crafty with your teaching. Yeah, you, okay. well, you got it. Lewis said I said I said I troll not. Remember? Remember you said that? Huh? When you talked to the disciples, they like I troll not. You remember that? He said it somewhere, I forgot where it was. He said Luke somewhere. You had to find that one. Yeah. He didn't say troll. Yeah. Troll? Yeah. <laughs> I don't know if it's like say meaning or anything, but yeah. it has to be a different meaning. It might be a different meaning. Yeah. Like, I just, he was like, he was saying like, I can't not Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. It's not T or O L L. I think so. It might just be one L. I think I do remember that script. I think I remember we might have, we was reading that one day and we was, I was like, what does that word mean? So Hey, why y'all looking for that? I'm gonna read this scripture. Hey, I'm gonna read uh this is Romans uh, ten and thirteen. For whosoever shall call upon the name of the Lord shall be saved. Oh, uh, first of all, you ain't gonna be saved unless you call on the name of the Lord. And the Father's name is Yahweh. The son's name is Yahweh Shai. It ain't Jesus. Yahweh. Oh, troll now. Yeah, that's one. Yeah, we read that in the park that one. Yeah, that's a good word. While you get that, I'm going to read this. But this is what I want to get right here. It said, how, how then shall they call on him in whom they have not believed? And how say they believe in him and whom they have not heard? So that going to that trolling people on the internet, putting videos on the internet, commenting on videos. If you see something that's going contrary to the Bible on a video on YouTube, you gotta comment. You gotta leave a comment, you gotta say something about it. And how shall they hear without a preacher? Like we always tell people, people always come up, oh, oh I believe in that, I believe in the Bible, I know I'm an Israelite. Then why aren't you out here preaching? You supposed to be, how do you, how everybody else supposed to learn if they ain't got a preacher? 
we're out here in the damn grimy ass weather. Out here in Gotham City. You know what I mean? Uh, and how shall they preach except they be sent? As it is written. Oh, well, as they, we, are, we sent out here. That's why we call apostles. Apostles means sent out. The Lord got us sent out. He ain't got everybody else sent out here. Who else you see be out uh, teaching on the streets consistently? Nobody. Just the Israelites. The people under GMS. Uh, really? Real messengers of your house and your stuff. How, and how shall they preach except they be sent as it is written? How beautiful are the feet of them that preach the gospel of peace and bring glad tidings of good things. But they have not all to obey the gospel. It ain't everybody obey the gospel. For Isaiah said, Oh, yeah, it's not pointing at y'all. Oh, yeah, yeah. This is for you. Because the Lord's about to come tear this motherfucker place up, man. You hear me? It's in the night. No. <laughs> right, that's a new one. It's coming soon. It's coming soon. Right. Bro, they got a new day every year with that one. Yeah, but you know, they teach you the world. The, they, you know, the church, the whole world gonna blow up. You know, but this ain't the world, man. It's, it's, it's the white man's world. Oh, he got, this he white got man is on his way out, man. Period. He's on his way out of power, man. And we're gonna be priests and gods up here, man. You know? But that's what we out here doing, prophesying the downfall of this goddamn devil, man. Goddamn devil. <laughs> shit. Real. Just we ain't niggas. We ain't black. Oh, or African American. Matthew 24. You're an Israelite. You're a Hebrew. That's your nationality. You're a Hebrew Israelite. You hear me? You know, this, what, this goddamn devil come up with them, them other names. Even Indian, man. They, it's in 24. You know, I don't know the exact word. Hebrew Israelite. From whatever tribe, you know? I can help you find it. A bitch, you know? No okay. oh, That's what they call the Jamaicans. He got that scripture though to answer your question. Cause we do everything like, you got a question, we gonna prove it with the Bible. We just ain't gonna make up no, no bullshit, you know what I mean? So y'all gotta get out here, that's the thing. We gotta get out here, wake up these people so they can learn and come out here and do exactly what we're doing. Cause the Lord is coming, he's coming to save his people. So if you don't know who you are, the Lord's gonna reward you when it's fire comes, man. Yep. We upload them to YouTube so people can learn, so you can go back and learn from them. I want them to learn from me too. Learn from you? Well, you gotta learn. You gotta learn the truth then. You just can't learn the truth. You know? Oh, that's that's one thing right there. It's like the Lord's name is, uh, the Lord's a Hebrew Israelite. So they spoke Hebrew. Jake loves Showtime, man. <laughs> yeah, yeah. So when the Lord got a Hebrew name. His name ain't Jesus. The Lord's name is Yahweh Shai. It's Yahweh Shai. Woe unto the wicked. That's yeah, where the name of the channels that they go to. Every Monday we out here. Go live right now on the Nah, we ain't live. We upload it later. We can go live. We can do that. But. That's what's sad. Hey, but hold on. Let me read the scripture for you. See, God don't like that. Matthew 24 and 36. Hey, hey, brother. He said, God don't like ugly. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, where you at? characteristics of an Israelite. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Joking. Talking you know? shit. Right. The Lord talks shit. It's all through the Bible. He talks shit, you know what I mean? Call motherfucking bitches. Yeah. He, names, everything. Yeah. He called these women bitches and hoes. <laughs> That's in the Bible. Go ahead. Matthew 24 and 36. It says, but that day and hour knoweth no man, no, not the angels of heaven, but my father only. As you asked when the Lord gonna return. So the scripture said the only one that knows is the heavenly father, the most high. So anybody talking about they know when the Lord returning, they a liar. They, they, so what we give to y'all is the Bible tells you signs, give you signs yep. of, of, of the, the look for around the time of his coming. You know it's close. Right, 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 exactly. Well, I got another one for you. Okay. Cause you can, everybody, you can tell we so in the last days. So what we looking day. for right now? We, I know we in the last days. Second Ezra's nine, yeah, yeah, yeah. Check yeah. it out. This is Second Ezra's nine and one. He answered me then and said, "Measure thou the time diligently in itself, and when thou seest parts of the signs past, which I have told thee before, then thou shalt understand that it is the very same time wherein the highest." will begin to visit the world which he made. 
like an example, like those forest fires that y'all been watching going on out in California, that's a sign that the Lord's about to come. And I'm talking about, um, ain't it like a thousand people that still miss them? Yeah, they miss them. That's crazy. I'm sorry, this is my life. All right, but listen, every Monday we out here at the same time. Yeah, be out here next Monday. Every Monday, man. What y'all say your website is? Whoa. Well, Woe unto the wicked. Whoa, like W-O-E. Right. You'll see uh, the eye. Woe unto the wicked? Yeah. Woe unto. Woe unto the wicked. U-N-T-O? Woe, yeah, U-N-T-O, wicked. And you'll see the icon is a mushroom cloud, the channel icon. Oh, check, one more. Put it in. Little brothers was listening though, wasn't they? Hey, Bundy, man. They was really, and yeah, this little brothers was listening, wasn't they? Right. He gave it to them. Cause they, usually did, I don't know, man. They gave it to them, man. They sure did. That was spirit, beautiful, right? And we out here it's in the fun, motherfucking, man. we out here in the bullshit ass right. weather. Right, right. And be like, why y'all out there? Right. We got these young young brothers right here. We're ice fishing right now. Yeah, I, it's ice fishing. <laughs> <laughs> we got, we got them. You drill the hoe. You know how they do it. Yeah. You know, some of them might build a tent, you know, and they're sitting there. Shit, we like Chili Willy out this you know motherfucker. You know what I'm saying? your boy Chili Willy. <laughs> That's my yeah. dude, man. Yeah. I'm gonna keep, I'm going to stay in this one. Yeah, yeah. Damn, man. Fucking finger. God damn. Sometimes when you got to give it to him, you got to give it to a person or not. Yeah. Hey, they was listening, but, it, you know. Okay. That's why the, they looked astonished, didn't they? Oh, man. I didn't see nothing. You can tell when so, you look in someone's eyes, bro. They was really, yeah, like, yeah. amazed. All three of them. Yeah. All three of them. Let's go. Oh, <laughs> Ah. It's alright, it's alright. Hey, give it to me, I'll read it. You wanna get it? I got it, I got it. You got it? I got gloves on. Y'all ain't, ain't gotta bring no gloves. I don't know if my warm gloves in the uh -oh. fucking car. I got these little seeing gloves. These ain't no. Yeah, that's all bullshit. Right. I got them $5 joints. When down, therefore, when there shall be seen earthquakes and uproars of the people in uh -oh. the world. Hey, that was just a big ass earthquake last night. Did you see that? No, no. Uh, shit, where was that at? I think it was in China. But I mean, it was, earthquakes been popping off. You get on that, what's that one YouTube channel? Uh, fuck, that one dude, he specializes in uh, earthquakes. Yeah, 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 uh, okay. I'm a, I'll subscribe to it too. I can't remember his name off the top of my head. He's bad, I think he was a former meteorologist. Oh and yeah. this motherfucker goes in on shit too, man. He been on coast to coast and everything. Hey, I had to give him a challenge. Tell him, you gotta leave the Bible alone though, cause you going off, bro. Yeah, he be going, he <laughs> trying to hit surface, don't Yeah, he? for real, man. Yeah, what is that dude's name? I can't remember. Yeah, he bad, man. Hey. Quit talking over me. Oh, <laughs> how can you hear what I got to say? You can still play with that shit, boy. Oh, <laughs> hey, that's a demon. Oh. Okay. Quit talking over me. How bitch? You be quiet. It's probably a lesbian, too. It says, here shall thou well, uh, well understand that. Oh, thing, thing with them earthquakes, man. Before they was popping off, there weren't really people dying, but now the motherfuckers are popping off and they people dropping dead. Yeah, getting swallowed up. Hell yeah, the earthquakes killing them for cause massive mudslides yep. and shit. All right, going back to that, the fires in California. California is like the most anti-Bible state in the whole country. Yep. They try to straight out ban the Bible in California. Right, they said you gotta register the Bible. Damn, <laughs> as a weapon, that's hey, a you weapon. gotta get registered. So. Yeah, that's crazy. Uh, Miley Cyrus, uh, King, whatever his name is, Jingler. Oh, God. Hey, this shit, all that shit burned up. Was, For real? Yeah, oh. honestly. That's good, man. Well, hopefully, um, that motherfucker keep burning. Um, I think Will Smith's one of theirs. The uh, roof is on fire. A lot of them motherfuckers, man. We're fleeing up out of that pit. Too bad they didn't die. Well, maybe they had. Yeah, maybe they disappeared. Remember their styles were missing. <laughs> <laughs> I just hope they don't get that shit put out. I hope it keeps burning. Oh, I'm here. I'm here. Yeah. And you look at the satellite images of that shit. Man, that shit look like that um, direct energy weapon type shit, man. That shit looks I, just I, I like seen, it. I seen some shit like that. That's crazy, man. It looks just like that acronym D-E-W. That direct energy weapon. Some of the fires, man. The house, the neighborhoods, the house is just burnt up, but the trees be like still blossoms, man. Crazy. You know, some of the trees is getting burnt up too, but some areas that only the houses get burnt up. And just the trees is still fucking snake. Then again, I mean that could be that 
Who knows what started it? Hey, this devil it. got some power. They do got that. The got they got some shit. shit. You know, when the most I bless that fucking devil for with the sun. You never know. Trump could be yep. like, okay, California, yep. don't. Uh, I got you. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Well, I but got you. Did he win California? No. No. <laughs> no. He, I don't think he did. Look at your boy. <laughs> he high stepping. He saw that. He going back to that. Esau going back to that. He high stepping. Yeah, it's Esau. Esau. Let's go with you. Got to. We commanded to come out here. All right, we reading the scripture. Uh, he is listening to what we's already into. This is. We going into this. The signs of the time. Oh, Read it. Oh. Authorized King James Version. King James. So this is originally part of the Bible. <laughs> but them goddamn oh, devils took it out. I don't know about that. I'm too much truth. Okay. Uh, okay. No wonder they flipped the religion. There you go. There you go. Okay, but what we're talking about, we're just talking about the sign of the times we're living in. Yeah. Therefore, when there shall be seen earthquakes and uproars, of the people in the world. Yeah, we know because there's a the high earthquake activity going on right now. I know you see them fires out in California, right? Most high destroying California. He said the hell with your California. <laughs> it burned. <laughs> right, right. You see all them shootings, some mass shootings, especially at the co the country. Oh, there's, there's a new mass shooting every day. Yeah, right. And really, we praise the Lord for that. Actually, mass that's shooting. a that's a spirit. The Lord put the spirits of vengeance out here. Yep. He put the spirit on people just to lose their minds and go right. crazy. That's what the truth does. Yeah. <laughs> people hear the truth. Sometimes they affect it in a negative way, and very few will wake up in a positive. Way. This whole damn world done went crazy. It's going mad. It's going mad, man. Going mad, man. It's beautiful. Then thou shalt well understand that the Most High spake of those things from the days that were before thee, even from the beginning. For like as all that is made in the world has a beginning and an end. Oh, everything got a beginning and got an end. So America got an end. And the end is manifested. The end, end is manifested. We get close to the end of America. We get close to the end of the period. We can buy being the kingdom. The Lord finna come back to the earth. That's right. That's right. Only a matter of time. That's right. You seen uh you seen how uh you know about the mark of the beast? The microchip? That's one of the yeah, that's one of the final prophecies that they ain't come to pass yet. But soon that that that's almost come to pass. Because, you know, the, the revelation talk about uh, right after that mark of the beast, that's when the fire is coming. And you can see they already starting to microchip everybody. Uh, have you seen what happened in Sweden? Almost the whole damn country of Sweden is going cashless. Everybody's getting all microchipped. Even over in China, it's almost all cashless. Soon they're going to start chipping everybody. That's right. It's, 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 it's going to be required to get a microchip Take you get money out of the bank, pay your rent, pay the bills, go ahead. Are uh, you good? In Venezuela, uh, China hooked them out. I guess they uh, have a new ID, ID paying system, so they can't buy groceries, they can't buy nothing without that ID. Hey. That's only going to lead to the chip. Yeah. Well, uh, I think that one, yeah, I think that one have an RFID. It's not the chip, but it's like a car thing. Yeah. That's going to lead to the RFID chip. Right. Either RFID or NFC. So they got different technologies. That being said, so we get the origin of religion. Religion, religion, really means bow, right? That's right. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's right. Yeah, because really, we dealing with truth, not religion. The Bible's a spiritual book. I know what you're right. No, I'm saying no wonder you know certain things that happen the way they happen because you know trying to mislead you know our yeah. people. With that. Yeah, I mean, because you got like uh, Israelite groups out here teaching that the mark of the beast is just sin or you know, an embargo or whatever crazy stuff they say. What the fuck the word going to the word mark? How are you going to in, uh, insert an embargo? <laughs> that don't even make sense. <laughs> but you got all, man, all kind of people out here deceiving people. Because yep. well, you make a lot of money off of teaching the Bible. You know, like most people out here teaching, they teach them from, like uh, the book of Titus says, for filthy lucre's so sake. That's a, that's a good way to make money. Oh, that's a bad way to make money. <laughs> <laughs> that's a quick, that's a shortcut to a missile. Yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> for real. 
for real. They did teach him for filthy lucre's yeah. sake. And they're taking away, man. That's it's like when you like set in churches where it's like, you know, they try to kid you for so like not doing this, for not doing that, you know. And it's like something feels like it's some sort of scare type of shit. Yeah, yeah. Oh yeah. Yeah. They hey, we got the wrong way. We got scare really, tactics too. Yeah, yeah. Because the beginning of the knowledge, like the scripture says, is the fear of the Lord. Right. Yeah. You know, but you don't you don't teach no falsehood like hell. Yeah. You don't teach. Because the real hell is that fire that's coming there to America. Yep. This place finna the Lord go. Cause you know, first the Lord uh, destroyed the earth with what? With the flood during the time yeah. of Noah. First death. Now he's finna bring that fire. Yeah. You know first what I'm saying? Second death. That's how he's gonna purify. Purify second, this place. Second death. Yep, the second death. That's the lake of fire. Is the Lord bringing that fire to the earth? That's the lake being delivered. It's actually going up, and they're looking down with the nuclear missiles hit. That's what they're looking down onto the lake of fire with the nuclear missiles hit. That's what the Lord bringing that spirit. He's wild. He's wilding up the spirit of these nations to come bring in the war of Armageddon. Yep. They're gonna, the war of Armageddon is going to be. They're going to shoot the nuclear missiles. They got a whole lot of missiles, yep. bro. Right. They got to the put that spirit in these devils to make that. Make them nuclear missiles for the day of destruction. You know, this guy's been using nuclear missiles in plutonium, uranium with their weapons, terrorizing Iraq, Afghanistan, parts of Africa, all of them. They've been, they've been, they've been dropping bombs since 2002, no, 2002, 2003. They've been, they've been dropping non bombs nonstop over there. And like over in Iraq, they pick up the soil, they do a test on the soil, they can't find no place they don't have. Um, uranium or uh, plutonium in it. Well, Satan constantly blasting them motherfuckers, man. But you know, the Lord, like I said, the Lord gave them the spirit to make them nuclear weapons to, to terrorize the world. Ever since Nagasaki and oh, Hiroshima was bombed, America's been living on a high horse, terrorizing the world, man. Which is prophecy. America had to destroy those nations to become this great power for a reason, because it's all prophesied. Most High made America great just so he can destroy America, you know? Because what do they do, man? These motherfucking devils realize that they, that our military, God, they even say God can't even destroy our military. These people are riding high on pride, man. You know? Riding high on pride, man. All they used to is going to people's nations and stealing what they got, taking what they got. And not just taking what they got, they kill the families first. Destroying families and shit, man. The great whore, the whore. The whore. Oh my goodness, it's cold. It's gross! What you look for, huh? Are you familiar with Yeah, that's real shit. It can be used in a good way, I guess. I don't know. But you don't want no nano tech in your ass, period. You know what I mean? You know? The nanobots run wild up in you. That's real. Yeah, that's real. Oh, here, I got you. Well, we talking about. Uh, yeah, because we supposed to fear the Lord, man, because I don't, I'm not trying to eat missiles, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> but, uh, second, that's why we come out, that's one of the reasons we come out here and do this work. We don't want to be destroyed. Well, we should see we out here doing Lord. this work, out in this weather, man. You know, it's a strange thing to see, though, ain't it? Brothers out here in this weather doing what we do, man. It, 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 it makes sense. Yeah, right. Exactly. a lot of sense. You know, if they knew what's coming, then it, uh, I'm going to read this right quick. Uh, 2 Corinthians 5 and 11. Knowing therefore the terror of the Lord, we persuade men, but we are made manifest unto the Most High, and I trust also are made manifest unto your consciences. So, but yeah, we know the terror of the Lord, so that's why we out here persuading people. <laughs> and, you got now, what I want to know is, I've been, I've been up to the wrong shit. Yeah, the past four years. Okay. Now, I've been wanting to fast. Who's preaching this truth? Oh, this is the exact truth on oh, you know, who we are and what, what we represent. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? And what we are bound. It's what we are surrounded by. You know what I mean? At the same time. Ooh. And uh, is it possible to make get what you got in the life? Oh, yeah. Yeah. That's the only way you're going to continue to learn this by like getting with brothers. Yeah, that's why we're out here. <laughs> for real. But I don't mind. Yeah. I, I get out here with you. We need help. Right. Hey, hey, what's that scripture? Uh, is that Matthew 12? Or... You read this one, you get that Proverbs 1 and 1. The Proverbs of Solomon, the sons of David, king of Israel. To know wisdom and instruction. 
to perceive the words of understanding, to receive instruction of wisdom, justice, and judgment, and equity, to give subtility to, to the simple, to the young man, knowledge and discretion. Because really, the majority of most brothers are coming in as young brothers like y'all. You know, we're special, I have to say, because we're elders, we're older. So that's rare as shit. The older brothers I, I told you, I was always mad, bro. I, I get it when I was all old. And shit. Well, I was probably about 30 or You're something right. like that I when was I was 40. Up. Yeah. 40. This brother was like young. Most brothers is young. Yeah, majority of most brothers is young. That's what the most high want, that young spirit. You know, that's, that's what he wants. That's what he wants. He was like 14 when he came in. Yeah, yeah he said that's, the, that's that new spirit. Yep. Hey, just like uh, when the Israelites was running around out there in the wilderness for 40 years, all the old generation had to die in, in the, before they could go into the kingdom and go into the promised land. Yep. You know about that story? Because yeah. when the Israelites went through the exodus to the Red Sea, they was out in the wilderness for 40 years. The Most High said, "Oh, y'all is not going into the promise because they was out there uh, murmuring." That's, that's why he keep mentioning the children of Israel. Yeah, that's why he keep mentioning. Yeah, well, it's all about the children of Israel, the sons of Israel. You know, it says, "A wise man will hear and will increase learning, you find that? and a man of understanding shall attain yeah, unto wise counsel, to understand a proverb and the interpretation, the words of Probably the wise." Also and their dark sayings. I got it. And we go into the mysteries and the dark sayings that we tell the people it goes in one ear and out the other. But we explain it to them, you know? The fear of the Lord is the beginning of knowledge, the but fools despise wisdom and instructions, you know? Because the fear of the Lord, man, you read the Bible, you read the Bible, you will see what the Lord did to us. For not listening. So you learning that he kicks your ass, yeah. you know, from going against him. So you're learning to fear the Lord and then your own personal life. Your personal life. Like now, he starts working with you. So we all commit all kind of stupid shit, all kind of sins, then he starts cleaning you up of those sins. Yeah, and you're gonna start going through hard times. But you gotta be a man and just deal with it. Oh, you you know, you can yeah. just deal with the hard times, man. You know? Like you that got fire a woman? Of affliction. The fire of affliction. That'd be the worst, that'd be the hardest time if you married, bro. Whoo! Yeah, I ain't even do it right. I was into the world. Type we all, we all were. Type, type stuff. I was into the world and stuff. You gonna learn to be so wise as shit that you gonna, you gonna know that you gonna have to, you, you still need the world to eat to live. You still gonna wanna go get a piece of pussy. What the scriptures say, use the world, don't abuse it. Damn, don't abuse it. That's right. That's right. Because some people want to do this thing, have one foot in the world and one foot in the tree. They part-time Israelites. Straddle the fucking fence. Yeah, yeah. Damn right, man. But hey, I got a good scripture, though. It's uh, Matthew 9 and 37. Then he said unto his disciples, The harvest truly is plenteous, but the laborers are few. Pray you therefore the Lord of the harvest that he will send forth laborers into his harvest. That's why we out here, you know what I mean? We got a harvest, a lot of a lot of harvesting. You know what I mean? A lot of work to do, bro, with no help. You know what I'm saying? It says the labor's on few. People don't want to do the work, man. They just they don't want to do it. Crazy. They just want people to tell you something, and then instead of them going to read, they just want people to tell them something. Yeah, they ashamed of the Lord anyway. They 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 more worried about looking foolish in the eyes of men than to, be, to look good in the eyes of the Most High. Right. They're more worried about what these people think than what the Most High got to say. Right. You know, like, oh, y'all look, look crazy out there. Y'all wear curtains, you know what I'm saying? Y'all look, y'all on the street corner, ain't nobody yeah, listening. That's that image they try to yeah. build you with. You know? I, 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 I'll be a fool for the Lord's sake, you know what right. I'm mean? saying? It says in Shabbat 23, In 19, such a man only feared the eyes of the Most High. Let me start up. Ooh, 15, the man that is accustomed to a previous word will never be reformed all the days of his life. Two sorts of men multiply sin, and the third will bring breath. A hot mind is as a burning fire. It will never be quenched till it be consumed. Because there's some niggas out here that just, they looking for a reason to cause trouble. You know, looking for a reason to argue. Just, just a no good niggas, man. It will never be quenched till it be put. <laughs> a fornicator in the body of his flesh would never cease 
so he has kindled a fire. All bread is sweet to a poor monger. He will not leave off till he dies. Some wild spirits out here. Huh? Break that last one. Well, down. With all bread is sweet to it. Yeah. Anything out here that's popping off. Drug dealing. Uh, you know what I mean? Murder, drug, robbery, theft. You know, it's, it's, it's good to them. That's their food and that's their knowledge. That's what sustains them. That's their food. Right. That's great. What? He says, what? He says, what he will not that? leave off. Till he dies, you know? He's he gonna be out here being a wicked son of a bitch until the most I kills him. Okay? A man that breaketh wedlock, saying thus in his heart, Who seeth me? You know my girl. I am compassed about with darkness. The walls cover me, and nobody seeth me. Thinking they can just continue doing wickedness, and oh, ain't nobody seeing me. Cops ain't locked me up. I'm, I'm, I'm untouchable. And I actually, I actually knew a nigga that had that on his license place. He was untouchable. Hey, yo, hey, Piece go. of shit! Hey, your boy 6 9 thought he was untouchable. Yes, he was He's like, that can't touch me. Y'all yeah. know you see your boy. Yeah, that's it. Uh, that He's gone mess. now. He out of there. That's a hot mess, man. Done. Yeah, that's a hot mess. He's yeah. gonna, they thinking he's going to be narking no, on no motherfuckers, man. Get out. He still ain't going to get out. Yeah, right. Yeah. That's on that Rico yeah. shit. That's yeah. that, uh, that racket shit. Yeah, he got, he got hit with gun charges and that racket team. It says, the walls cover me and nobody sees me. What need I to fear? The Most High would not remember my sins. <laughs> Such a man only fears the eyes of men. I, I hate these people, man. Such a man only fears the eyes of men and knoweth not that the eyes of the Lord power are 10,000 times brighter than the sun, beholding all the ways of men and considering the most secret hearts. Motherfucker, thank you. Just keep walking around. I mean, you. A lot of times you see a motherfucker that was a piece of shit ten years ago, who just happened to run into him again. Nigga still doing the same shit. And you're like, what? This is actually scriptural in that night. We wonder how he did. How's he still alive? Yeah, I, I can't remember that. <laughs> it's, I think it's around here somewhere. Oh, we brought that out once. <laughs> Cause you know, people rather, like, like you said, they feared man more than uh, uh, the Lord. So, like, you got like a lot of pastors now. They saying uh, you, it's okay to be a homosexual. You know, you know what I mean. But uh, if we come out here and teach that according to the Bible, everybody gonna come against us. You know what I mean? Cause we're not being politically correct. Everybody won't be all politically correct. You know what I'm saying? The Lord ain't with that shit. They don't want to upset nobody. Yeah. Let's agree, let's agree, let's agree. Yeah, everybody's afraid to upset everybody, you know what I mean? Yeah. That's why, go ahead. That's why people come up like, hey, y'all should, y'all should, uh, uh, what do they say? Uh, y'all should, the tone or whatever. yeah, yeah, y'all gotta soften it down a little bit. Y'all should be uh, a little nicer. Ha <laughs> <laughs> uh, Maybe some of them follow you. Like, nigga, that's the point. Like, this, the Lord said, me, your car, we be our chosen, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> the Lord spoke rough all the time. The whole Bible's rough. It's a manly Bible. It's a big book, I mean. Well, Bible means book. Yeah, man. The Shirach 16. It is, though. It is. Shirach 16 and 11. And if there be one stiff neck among the people, it is marvel if he escape unpunished. <laughs> For mercy and wrath are with him. He is mighty to forgive and to pour out displeasure. <laughs> so we do want, I mean, like, like, like a, just a scripture that says that a lot of the wicked are preserved until the day of destruction. So we see a lot of wicked, no good motherfuckers walking around, continually do all kind of dirt. The most high just, no matter, and I've seen people have, have their head gone. I've seen motherfuckers, I got cousins that's still alive that was shot, man, a total of over 20 some time. Should be dead, man. But the most high got the motherfuckers here so they can oh, burn up. First you know, all kind of shit can happen to them. They, they ain't gonna never gonna die until the, until the most high burns them, man. <laughs> For real. What you about to get? People just don't understand what's going on. The most high control of everything, man. From the smallest matter to the greatest matter. We can some bitches. Oh, that is that. I think he lets you continue on. I'm making sure you get it. That's right. That's right. What's wrong with that? That's right. It does something to your spirit. And, you know, he lets you go on. You know, but the more you do it to your spirit, you he's going to put it to where you don't know it. Right, 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 right. That's the see the wicked. A lot of them, he done blinded to what's yep. going on. He's just literally blinded. Put the blinders on. 
So no matter what's going on, no matter what's going down, the truth ain't gonna hit them until the last moment when it's too late. That's when they're gonna be given the truth when it's too late. Cause that shame is gonna be on them. That's what's gonna that's how I was gonna mess you up too. That's cool. Like man, when you first start teaching, after a while you've been teaching, man, you get used to it. Right. But when you first start teaching, bro, you think, you know, you <laughs> could just teach anybody, you know what I mean? Right. But you can't, because most, the mo you gotta realize the most I put the spirit of blindness on a lot of these fools. <laughs> That's right. And it is, you can't help them. That's right. That's so, only, uh, that's only you right. can't get all messed up, because some brothers might get discouraged about their teaching. And most people ain't, most people just ain't gonna listen to you. That's something you got. You just gotta know. You know what I mean? These people don't care about the Lord. They don't. They don't care about these scriptures. You know what I mean? But okay. regardless, even when you teach those motherfuckers, they're gonna get it. You're you still get marked. Marking them. Get still marked. Marking them. So that's a joy, though. It's actually a joy. Yeah. Because what the scriptures also say there's a joy in the presence of angels when just one sinner repents. So we come out here and teach a thousand people, and only one person wakes up. That's beautiful. The scripture actually say that. In the book of Ecclesiastes, it said, he counted, there's Ecclesiastes 7. He said he only found one righteous man out of a thousand. Yeah, I'm already there. Oh, are you? Okay. Eight bucks okay. Back yeah, uh, that's the spirit. Ecclesiastes 7. That's Luke 15 and 10. Oh, yeah. Well, go ahead, read it. Likewise, I say unto you, there is joy in the presence of the angels of the Most High over one sinner. That yeah, so the word of the Most High don't go out void. You know what I mean? So you like might upload a YouTube video, get five views. But that one of them five views could have been a brother that got, he, he started making videos. Now, now he got 500,000 views. <laughs> right. You know what I mean? Right, right. Or something, you know what I mean? Let me start at seven. The spirit of the Lord is, is magnificent. Right, let me start at seven, 15 and seven. I say unto you that likewise joy shall be in heaven over one sinner that repented, yeah. more than over, over 90 and nine just persons which need no oh. repentance. Who the hell is fire? So the most high, the angels, man, they literally, I mean, your mind will blow up. Just trying to think of how they celebrate. Yeah. Well, how the angels <laughs> celebrate, yeah. For real, man. Things right. light up. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, too. Shit. Earthquakes and shit. Yeah. Yeah. Earthquakes. Yep, yep, yep. Deaths. Yeah, burn, burn Massive a fire. deaths. Yeah, start a fire and pour it <laughs> Cause a tidal wave. You know? For real. That's beautiful. The angels be out there. They, they wreck havoc on the earth. They come, the scriptures say that. Was that revelation about how the angels up in the... Uh, the rivers Euphrates and all that, they gonna be the ones that get his arm and get him popping off. Ecclesiastes 7, Whew. let me start at 27. It says, Behold, this have I found, saith the preacher, this uh, King Solomon, son of David. Ooh. He says, Counting one by one to find out the account, which yet my soul seeketh, but I find not. One man among a thousand have I found. But a woman among all those have I not found. So he said, I have a thousand men, that one righteous man. But I have a thousand people, not a single righteous woman. So we're not out here to teach women either. If the woman wants to listen, all right, she can listen. But we're not like, you gonna find out the main scoffers are the woman. Why yeah. y'all, why y'all teaching y'all? That's what the Bible is. How many times we hear it, man? How many times we done heard? Jesus love everybody. My, my, my grandmama taught me the Bible. Yeah, my grandma taught me. Grandmama feeding you all kind of pork and yeah, yeah. <laughs> shit. telling you the Lord love everybody. Yeah, Grandma killed Granddad. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> gave his ass a heart attack. <laughs> yeah, that's true. Shit. shit, for real, man. My, I'm telling you, man. Like, I love my mom to death, but my dad couldn't wait to die. <laughs> oh, he couldn't wait to get out of wow. here, man. He couldn't wait to get out of here. I heard I was on mouth. He couldn't wait to get out of here, man. You know. Damn, that's real. rough. He was mad. He he told them, don't don't resuscitate me. Don't bring me back to this motherfucker. Shit. Yeah, my dad said the same shit. He signed a paper that said that. Wow. Okay, something happens, he right, said, right. do not put Ain't me on that. Ain't that mad? Something about our dad's got yeah. a little bit of wisdom, they, you know. They, he said, do not put me on that fucking they, machine. Damn right. They don't 